Okay, so we're capped out on... Oh, where where am I? We don't need you guys there. What we need is as much food as possible. Because, yeah, I don't need any more coal. There we go. So in that case, seeing as I still have a bunch of idle people just sitting around, uh, first and foremost, let's finish this housing block. And then we're going to need more trees. But I, I want to get another academy. See, one of you seen Ascendants of a Bookworm. Thank you and shall would like it. I read the manga for it. I thought it was decent. I might consider uh, watching the anime, but I just... I don't know. I've been working on my own solo projects recently, and so it's left me with very little time to sit down and watch too much. But I guess we did watch Indiana Jones yesterday. The first one. I... It was surprisingly good. How are we doing on food? I could cap out a bit more. I don't know. I, yeah, surprisingly good just in terms of like, hey, I read, I read this. I watched this as a kid and thought it was amazing. And now that I'm older, like it, it held up for the most part. I felt like the handle handling of the female character, uh, Mar Marion. There we go. I felt like she was a bit of a weak point for the movie, that they, they very much just had her as the damsel in distress. I always found that just a little bit of a tired concept from a viewership perspective. Let's see, maybe get another hanger? Maybe. I'm gonna... Really, I only need one hanger right now, especially because there's efficiency upgrades that I can get if I get another academy. Okay, we're tilting a little bit in the front. Which honestly makes sense. If I do lift, we need more wood. Well, you know what? There's plenty of wood over here. And if I can get just a little bit more, we could potentially do another repeller. Hey, wing upgraded. I don't care too much about construction costs. That's cheap. Let's reduce our coal costs for a moment. Okay, so where's the... Oh, the Golden Sphere is all the way out there. I'm gonna get some wood real quick, though. Let's get storage. Let's get one more... Do we get one more water tower right here? Let's see. Oh, well, that was quick. And that's why I don't think I need another hangar. Especially if I give them the efficiency upgrade so that they just, like, yoink everything. Yeah, sadly, that's the way it was those days and just carries over. Yeah. I guess it's just one of those where it was... A lot easier for me to uh, notice, like, how they could have fixed the movie. Maybe now that I'm older, maybe that I'm more aware, but it was just sitting there being like, oh man, they could have done this and this, and it's like, eh, it's fine. Anyway. We spot an object glistening in the sunlight, encircled by runes. As we approach it, it reveals into a smooth and round shape. Immediately we recognize it as one of the golden, golden spheres, a piece of the rumored Nomad's Ori. This wondrous ancient construction would help our kingdom immensely. Carefully hoist the sphere upon our platform, knowing we're one step closer to building the Nomad's Ori. I don't know. I have that problem sometimes. Whenever I see a piece of media that I like, 
I will sit there and I'm not critiquing it necessarily, but in my head the entire time I'm thinking, oh, they could have done this and this and it would have just been so much better. Uh, and I realize, like, for the time, it is what it is, and, you know, I can't complain too much in that regard. But it still holds back a lot of media for me. A combination of art school and, uh... And, you know, video game reviews effectively have left me maybe a little bit too much of a critic. Okay. So we, we capped out on the lift upgrade. Yeah? Yeah. It also does not look like coal regrows particularly quick. So I will keep that in mind in my travels. But we definitely have a Tree of Harmony up here that I can grab. And then I think we'll swing over and check out whatever's on this island and then swing back down. Here. Here's a bunch of coal. What am I doing? We're also probably going to need some water. I wouldn't say it's jaded. Jaded would be like all movies are bad. But that's not an issue. Also, I apparently never looted this, this relic here. Okay, let's just wait until we're full up on coal. I don't think we need more than that. We definitely need more water than this. We near a lone peaceful tree, surrounded by ruined walls. We feel more serene the closer we approach. Immediately, we recognize it as one of the trees needed for the rumored Tranquil Gardens. This wondrous ancient construction would help our kingdom immensely. We pick its seeds with delight, knowing we're one step closer to being building the Tranquil Gardens. That moment was beautiful and calming. We knew our kingdom reached ever closer to greatness. I feel like these people are very much in danger of going full cults. Okay, so we're capped out on coal. Let's get as much water as we can. I'll probably want to up the efficiency upgrades in terms of... That looks like a kingdom over there. Uh, efficiency upgrades in terms of water consumption. Speaking of, don't forget to drink some water. Alright, so that reduces my coal requirements. I think, uh, let's see, what am I... I'm good on both. I guess let's go for the water upgrades. Also, seeing as we're starting to stack up. Let's just waste some wood. Seeing as I'm gaining wood constantly here, let's do that. Whoops. Nope. We gotta go to... Cantus Crossing, looks like. I'm hoping we get some kind of food production going on here. Maybe we do. Cantus Crossing. The people of Cantus live near the Valley of Kings, and thus greatly value the treasure of the ancients. They are mesmerized by our flying machines, and their council wishes to speak. The name Cantus was a portmanteau of two ancient words, both meaning treasure, hearkening to their admiration for the past. Of the kingdoms of this in this legend, Cantus was one of the most kind to the founder. Okay, we asked for technologies. So they've got ore, propulsion, 
low cost, no fuel. One worker, low speed. Street lamp, light, which can illuminate paths to make people happy. Requires glass, farm. Fresh plot of land ready to be sown. Creates one food for every, for water, uh, for one food for one water every three hours, which workers must deposit in storage before continuing. Can clump together with other farms. And charcoal hut. Transforms wood into coal, which is stored at the town center. Workers don't like living near the coal hut because of the fumes. Unfortunately, we need more stuff. Quests. They have a request. A band of seekers is not returned for a long while, sent to a particularly desolate part of the Valley of Kings. They're searching for a tome described in legends, but must have become lost along the way, or perhaps worse. The seekers have the only transport caravan in Cantus that can reach the Valley of Kings. If we could find the seekers and bring them home, their allegiance would be assured. The seekers of Cantus dared the wastes, all in the desire for further knowledge. The tasks came with grave risks, and while the reverence was abundant, so was mourning. Alright, well, that's easy. Okay, so we pause for a second. So I want to take a look at research. So we now have propulsion ore. Generates propulsion, low cost, cheap to build, no fuel. One worker, low speed. I'll have to take a look at that. Because I'm not necessarily against some of these things. We should probably research the farm. Maybe? That'd mean we'd have to be very... Aggressive for water. Is there something fancy out here? That's the one thing I want to double check. Let's cap out and then we'll send somebody here. Okay, where did they say? Out here. Well, that was going there next anyway. We're running a little low on lift. That is a good point. Fortunately, I'm going to need some more people. Oh. I'm going to need as many people on that. There we go. Let's see, lift, wait. Do I want to do this? If I put it over here, it's going to be worse. I love seeing those sails just sloop out. It's not a really realistic building animation, but that's fine. Alright, how are we doing on coal? I could stock up a smidge. Not that we're in particular need. Do your people repro repro uh, reproduce? No. Part of it is, time does not pass very quickly in this game. Uh, so most games would have like a day-night cycle be a year within their time, but in this game it's it's just an hour. Just kind of pleasant. I'm just noticing, like, all sorts of things to check out. Because that's another kingdom over there. Uh, but I'll, I'll do this first. One thing at a time. No, we're going to check out this ruin. Seeing as we're right here. Settlers of the Gale. Oh, it's not a ruin. People live here. Squat frame hold, holds an ancient wind spinner. 
A small settlement has formed around it, though the spinner itself has been broken for a long time. The wind spinner did not function, for the settlers knew not how it worked, but formed a settlement around its attached shelter. Okay, I'll take two more. Okay, so we've got we got lift for days. So let's get another propeller. My coal costs are minimal. Oh, here's another one. Small settlement. Look for migrants. Okay, so we need jubilant. We need jubilation. So desire is first and foremost street lamp. And then I should probably make myself some things. Okay, first and foremost, send a worker to the Relic Rune. Relic Rune. Relic Rune. And Ancient Rune. Another rune of the old empire, rotting in the winds of the barrens. Seems there's more to this rune below ground, but we ha hazard but we hazard to attempt a voyage inside, for it may collapse at any moment. The runes reminded us of our task's import that the fragile empire we sought to create would need constant tending. We nearly leave, but among the ru rubble of a collapsed tower, a ruby red scarf catches our eye. Was this the location of the Seekers from Countess? We scramble to remove the fallen stone. Quickly, we hear jubilant shouts from below the tower's base. The Seekers had thought themselves forever lost, but are now saved by a sign of a renewed empire. If you wish to join our council, we immediately, uh, be, immediately upon rescue, and we happily oblige with relieved hearts, we journey back to Cantus. The Seekers were the most devoted to the old empire. They were fascinated by our machinery and sought answers to many technical questions. Okay. So we now have lamp. Let's go back to propulsion. Let's grab ore. Okay, so I'm going to need more before I can upgrade that. Are we good here? Okay, I think we are. So... Let's probably just keep going for the, uh... The food and efi food efficiency. Did I get everything else in this immediate area? Okay. Let's return home. I gotta get some lights. Oh, we need glass. So we actually need... We need the glass smelter. Yeah. I'll shift to that. We'll get, we'll get these done real quick before I look into anything else. I might want to look into the efficiency upgrades for these as well. Okay, so while we're at it, let's grab wood. Wood and water. Do I want a quick swing by, check this little island out? I might as well, seeing as I'm here. Because the more areas that I can properly discover and kind of mark off my map, the better. Okay, resource. Glass smelter. So this cannot be near houses. I'll put that there. We might have to move it later. But that's okay. Because this will give us sufficient ports for glass. Alright, so now we've got farm researched. If we go back to resources. We can increase the efficiency on those. I'll think about it. Stock warehouses. 
Yeah, I want to grab those. Let's start with the increased propulsion. Just so I don't have to build any more propellers for a while. Is there anything fancy out here? Doesn't look like it. Let's very quickly scoot to that one and see what we've got. Okay, I already, I already found the runes there. Or relics there? Cool. And there. Not a whole lot of food sitting around in this immediate location. But as I am an airborne scavenger, I'm just going to top off whenever I go buy anything major. Have we gotten water stacking yet? Nope. Okay, so we should have plenty of glass. Desires, street lamp. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, okay. So that's mildly unfortunate. I was really hoping the street lamp would just be an upgrade. I wonder if people can walk through it. Well, if I put that there, hopefully... Hopefully people will just walk straight past it. Okay. Works perfectly. So, it's not, an, it's not an upgrade per se, but I can use it as such. Uh, let's see, propulsion. Well, my propulsion is pretty maxed out with the ones that I've got. Do we increase warehouse sizing? Maybe. Let's pause for a moment. Increase coal storage. That'll take a while. Oh, increase maximum possible speed by 10%. That won't take long. All right, so where are we at? Can I? Nope. All right. Well, let's just bring him straight back. And more planes than hangar. I just never quite have enough people to justify it. Currently, I've only got five people that could... No, I've got exactly seven people that could be using the gliders. Uh, what I should do, instead of more people on it, is... Uh, let's see. We go back to... Is it basics hangar? What I should get is actually the increased resource gather rate by 50 and then 100%. Getting both of those uh, effectively doubles the efficiency of all of the planes that I already have. And that's more than enough. Okay. So if I wanted to make a farm, how big is it? Kind of big. Okay, we're tilting a little bit to the right. Unsurprising, though, considering the situation. Let's just handle this and then we'll maybe do a redesign. What I'll probably do is just extend to the sides or back a bit. A great festival is awarded to the returning seekers and us, their sa saviors. So much jubil jubilance abounds. We swear the kingdom grows in size and beauty. The remaining seekers are convinced. With the blessings of their kingdom, they will join us too. The people are overjoyed to our proposal, proposal of allegiance. We must build a skyport to connect Cantus to the wider world. Okay. Do I have enough? I have just enough. The Council of Cantus was so grateful of our return that they alighted from their dais and proposed our people take their place for the night. There were ten chairs, so the ten original settlers took their places. It was here that the term the founder of the Nine was coined. Okay, ask for technologies. Do we get a charcoal hut? 
It converts wood into coal. I guess there's nothing wrong with picking it up. I might have to be a bit choosier with the tech I buy. Okay. So I will just hang there. Oh, we have no research. Okay, let's do research efficiency. And boost our clay production. Because we're going to need more adobe. Okay. Inhabitants wish 66% of paths were well lit. Only 20%. Okay. So, we need to look into lights. That's a horrible place, though. Okay. I'll have to figure out about lumps. Well, we are now allied with Cantus Crossing. Great! The Skyport complete, blah blah blah, they will continuously send us more wood. I was really hoping it would be something other than wood, but I will take a wood gain, all the same. Okay, desires. Honestly, let's just do a street lamp on every every immediate corner. Let's see, how much glass do I have? I've got a decent chunk. So this might end up meaning we get some uh, some overlap here. But I'm fine with over overlap in this situation. Let's see, I should be able to get rid of this, yes? No. Or lamp. Where'd that leave? Oh, this one. Really? Hmm. Okay. Well, I was gonna try and be tidy about this. Oh. Maybe the lamps just don't count. Because people can absolutely walk through street lamps, but they don't count as structural support. Well. That's frustrating. I guess it's time to just randomly place lamps... My favorite thing to do. Let's see. This one sucks. Because I'd like to have that properly lit. I mean, I guess I could put a lump there. Uh, let's see. Oh. Yeah, we're just gonna go for maximum coverage. I can and will move them later. We're gonna need some quartz, though. I swear I saw quartz nearby. Maybe not. Eh, yeah, whatever. We'll find it as we go. 
Oh. We also apparently ended up with more people as a result of that last thing. So, housing blocks. Okay, I'm gonna... wood? No. Not enough lift to support weight. Okay, good. It won't crash my... my setup. Well, in that case, pause, lift, wing. We're waiting for this to happen. 